I've been in your shoes before. I've had this thought before where I, I started doubting if, if my twin was even my twin because I don't feel that we look alike at all, at all. Although I do see his face in mine like on an energetic level, like I can see his eyes in mine or when I'm filming, I feel like I see his face in mine. But on a physical level, I just don't feel like we look alike at all. And I used to start doubting myself like, oh, well, we don't look alike, so we can't be twins. Like I look more like my spouse. Okay, but he's, he's a soulmate. He's not my twin. And I used to doubt the journey because of that, but that none of that matters. None of that matters. You don't need to look like your twin for you to be twin flames, okay? Most twin flames don't even really fully, don't even really look alike. Some may look alike to a certain extent. They have some similar features. It's usually within the eyes that you can tell, but don't worry about it. You know, doubts will definitely kick in and it sucks and you just have to surrender. The, the surrendering part is one of the hardest things to achieve on this journey. I know, but I've surrendered. I've been where you are and it sucks. Like it was like I was self-sabotaging my own journey. I was like constantly looking for things to doubt this journey, to sabotage this journey because it didn't make sense. And I was literally trying to find everything and anything to just be logical and say, no, there's no way we can be twin flames. But every time I would do that, I would get one, I would get really sick, like really, really sick. Um, I've gotten to the point where I had swollen lymph nodes on my head. I've never gotten that in my life. They were on my head and I thought I had brain tumors. Like it was, it was scary. I couldn't move my head. I couldn't move my neck because they were that swollen. And it was the moment I started doubting. And, um, and I was just constantly getting sick. Every time I would doubt, I would constantly get sick. And then as soon as I would say, okay, you know what, God, um, I leave this in your hands. I'm going to trust you. I need to stop. Tr I need to stop doubting. I would be fine. I haven't gotten sick because well, I've gotten sick before, but like it was more like ascension symptoms, you know, but extreme sick. No, I haven't gotten extreme sick since, um, since I stopped doubting. So stop doubting. It doesn't matter if you guys look alike or not. All that matters is your connection. It's what you feel in your heart. Now don't become delusional. If this person is a karmic and is toxic and is treating you poorly, then don't become delusional because I'm seeing that a lot. But don't worry about those things. It doesn't matter.